Hi, my name is Iris and today's activity is a Danish tradition called Gekkebrev or Snowdrop Letter. Um, so when I was a child we would cut out these shapes, write poems inside and send them off to our friends. So the materials you need for this is some paper, um, a pencil or a pen and some scissors. Um, <clears throat> Let me just show you first with the paper. You need to fold it quite a few times. So if I just fold it like so, make sure I've got a square bit. I've got some excess paper here that I'll just cut off. If you need help with this, just ask an adult. Uh, you then want to fold the length of the paper that's been folded already over like so. And I think maybe I'll fold it just one more time. Here we are. <clears throat> so I've got some bits here that doesn't have any folds. And I think I'll quite like my no drop letter to be in a round shape so I'm just going to cut this so it looks a bit like um, ice cone or a co just a cone um, now I can cut different shapes into the paper here um, and the reason why I've got a pencil is it's quite good to just draw the bits you want to cut out so just cut out a triangle here And you can just follow the lines, like so. Maybe I want <clears throat> a wavy bit here. And again, just you can just cut after the line. That's a tricky one, so maybe you can ask someone to help you out with this one. Um, quite like triangles, so maybe I'll just continue cutting them out. So it's quite nice to do these letters because you can't really go and visit your friends, but in this way you're in contact with them <coughs> through your letters. I'm just going to open up and see how it looks like. So this is the exciting bit, kind of reveals how your snowdrop letter is going to look. I think that's quite nice. So now when you've made your snowdrop letter, the only thing you need to do is write a little teaser poem in here. So the person who receives the teaser poem has to guess who the sender is. Um, they have a clue. This dots for as many letters there are in your name. So my name is Iris, I-R-I-S. So I'll put four dots on there. Let me just read out loud an example of a teaser poem you could read, uh, write. I found a snowdrop early on. Yet, the same day, my name was gone. Help me find my name today. Can you guess it? Please, I pray. So, you can send it off to um, a friend or family member. Uh, it could be someone in your house. Uh, but you could also, um, if you can, of course, go out on a small walk with a parent or an adult. Um, and send it off uh, by hand. If you can send it by post, you could also do that. Um, so yeah, good luck with your snowdrop letter and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.